Trill County track. Femke Bo just set the indoor 400 meters record running a 49.26. And we all know that she came in second behind Sydney McLaughlin in the 400 meter hurdles. So if she's able to do that in the 400, the indoors, imagine what she'll do outside. So that just lets you know just that Sydney could dominate in the 400. Because for Bo to have that much success already this season in the indoor, just imagine what Sydney would do. Because Sydney already beat her in the hurdles. So it just lines up for Sydney to take that next step and be a dominant 400 meter runner. Because like I, I keep saying, it's easier to run the four. You're just running. You're not having to jump over hurdles. So could the 400 possibly even be better for Sydney? Because like I said, for a 50 bowl to dominate like she did, and she came in second behind Sydney McLaughlin, that lets you know that Sydney's going to put up crazy times. And I don't really think that Bo is in the same category as Sydney McLaughlin if she chooses to run the 400, which I think this booster of, of confidence she gained from seeing what Femke Bo just did is going to be all she needed to be like, you know what? I think I can attack that 400. I think I can make something happen and possibly get the world record in the 400. So... I can't wait to see her decision. I can't wait to see her run the four. I want to see her run it against Femke Bo. Just the, for the fact that Femke Bo just set that, that new indoor record. I want to see what Sydney McLaughlin could do against her. So, y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section. Make sure y'all like the video and subscribe to the channel. I'm 